Well, Glenda, the superintendent tells me that the student who brought the gun to school is on indefinite suspension pending a board review. He expects, though, that child will be expelled. Parents, though, awfully worried, especially everything that happened, including that shooting in Connecticut. The 11 year old had the gun at Hazel Park Junior High School all day long and no one knew it. And I was just freaking out. <laughs> Parents like Carrie Walker found out from a letter that the district sent home with her child. I just, I couldn't believe it. The boy had the 9mm semi automatic handgun, similar to this one, in his backpack in his locker, loaded. I couldn't imagine ever getting a phone call like those other parents, never. Nope. Her son, who's in the seventh grade, says the principal came to their classroom yesterday and told them all they didn't have to be scared. School would still be in session and stuff, and, all, and he said not to worry about it, just keep on doing our best in school. School officials never saw the gun during the day. It fell out of the child's pocket after school on his way home when he apparently got involved in a dispute with other kids. In sixth grade. Sixth grade. How does a sixth grader get a gun? I don't understand it. Police are seeking charges against the 11 year old and anyone else involved. They say there are questions about who the gun actually belongs to. The child told school officials he stole it from his older sister's bedroom. And school officials understand that older sister to be an adult, someone that's not in their school district. Parents obviously upset because they don't want a repeat of what happened in Newtown. Again, that student on indefinite suspension likely facing expulsion. We're live from Hazel Park, Julie Bonovich, 7 Action News.